the Disneyland monorail. Yes, no. yeah. We are now beginning a two and a half mile journey. To this catch a ride with Fresh Baked is being brought to you by Alan de Guzman and L. Stevens. We dedicate this ride on the monorail to you. And if you would like to have a catch a ride uh, dedicated to you, all you have to do is follow us on Facebook. On Fridays, we'll make an announcement on our Facebook page asking you to submit your request for a catch a ride. And just do that. Put your <laughs> Tell us what rides you want us to ride on. We will pick one dedicated to you, like we are dedicating this one to Alan de Guzman and L. Stevens. Thank you, guys. And, uh, and we'll make it happen. All right, guys, thanks a lot. No, you can't. Wow, look at that. Everything's gone. Prior to Disneyland closing, please remain seated until the monorail comes to a complete stop and the doors have opened. Then gather your belongings, lower your head, watch your step, and on the bus. Please on Earth. Disneyland is truly cool yes. American original. Since its opening in 1955, it has hosted hundreds of millions of guests from around the world, including presidents, kings, and celebrities. It is the original Disney thing. Oh, yeah. oh, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He, I mean, he fractured his foot. Yeah, my foot's kind of busted. But... Oh. Yeah, that's like when you said yes, I was like, no. <laughs> I just looked at her kind of funny. I was like, yes. I know. I've said that to some people before. They're like, yeah, I'm like, are you stupid? Across the way are the icy peaks of Matterhorn Mountain. Now look, I see the sun. And beneath us is the Octavia, where drivers of the sun, the sun, and gold spires of one of Disney's most beloved attractions. It's a small world. And now we're riding alongside the happiest kingdom of them all, Fantasyland. Home to Pinocchio, Snow White, Peter Pan, and other storybook characters. Wow. Yeah, right. It looks weird without, all that, without any water in there. Right. I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> and they keep the light on where like uh, like the caverns are on the oh, really? side, the big blue light. You can see it at night. You're like, what? Yeah, I don't like that. Find your belongings, watch your head, and step carefully from the train. On right. behalf of all of our crew, oh. thanks for traveling with us. Don't say it. And we hope you'll Boy. have a happy Boy. and memorable <laughs> visit here at Disneyland. This is the Tomorrowland Monorail Station. <laughs> Next stop is going to be right here at Princess Fantasy Fair to check out the Frozen show once again. We saw this last week. I'm filming it again to get a better full shot because I, we didn't have the best of seats and I'm hoping to get a better one this time. In the meantime, I'm going to enjoy this uh, poison apple freeze that you can get at, at uh, Maurice's Treat Cart. It's pretty awesome, just like the Red Apple Freeze, but different. Anyway, uh, stand by because we're probably not going to show this in the video because we just showed it to you last week. I don't want to do the same thing over here. So it's about 5 o'clock. We just wrapped the Frozen show at uh, Fantasy Fair. It had a decent spot. I thought I was going to get front row center. I was one of the first few people in there, but they're all, all the good seats are actually reserved for, I don't know, for, I don't know for who. <laughs> Our VIPs for Princess Fantasy Fair. Come on. Anyway, uh, so I had to get off to the side a little bit, but still, it was a good, uh, good spot. We got to see the whole show and got a clean shot, so I'm happy about that. Love that show, by the way. Just love it. Um, yeah, so we're heading back down Main Street because, well, most of Disneyland is, is closed. <laughs> or the rides are down anyway, you know, like I, I couldn't decide what to do. I, we're going to head over to DCA for a little bit and see what's going on over there. We, uh, we got a shot of um, Grizzly Peak earlier and I want to see if I can see anything else. And then who knows, maybe we'll do a ride or two on the way. Yeah, it looks like we just missed the uh, flag retreat ceremony. You know, we only got that on film once. That's a pretty good uh, little piece of Disney. Disney history or Disneyana, if you will. It's a, it's a pretty neat show.
they were retiring the flag as we speak. through the Esplanade over to DCA. I want to take a second to remind everybody that we have launched a, a, a second channel for Fresh Baked. Uh, we did that because the <laughs> Fresh Baked Disney proper is getting full. Um, and I, what I mean by that is that we have a lot of content out there that people don't even know that we have. Uh, you know, we've got, we've got playlists and stuff set up and you can find it on the channel, but the more we do, the more stuff gets buried and, and I wanted to find a place to you know, a second place to put stuff so that I can focus, you know, our, our, our regular channel on the trip reports and the secrets and stuff like that. And then on the other channel, it's going to be called Fresh Baked Presents. It's actually already up. We launched a, uh, or we launched it with the, with the podcast, last podcast we did. And that's going to be for other special features, probably the ride throughs. And, uh, you know, I, I, I don't know, anything else that we can think of that's not, that you can't really narrow down right into either a trip report or something about the secrets and history of Disneyland, which those are going to stay right here on the channel so if you have a minute head over to that new channel subscribe if you can if not you know it's okay we're still going to be publishing everything on facebook and google and twitter and all that so you can find us no problem if that's how you get your media